Helicon Foundation Repair uses compaction grouting to repair sinkholes, which can cause damage to homes and structures. Helicon has successfully completed thousands of compaction grouting projects throughout Florida. An engineering company will supply us with a grout plan map showing all the grout point locations. On the first day of the project, our drilling supervisor will walk the site with the engineering monitor to mark all the grout point locations on the grout plan, which are normally spaced approximately 10 feet apart around the perimeter of the structure. Some grout points are drilled at an angle to direct grout beneath the footprint of the home or structure. The exact degree of the angle is determined by the engineer, and the entire compaction grouting process is monitored by an engineering company. The threaded drill casing used is Schedule 80 steel, which meets ASTM engineering standards in thickness and thread. Our drillers are the best in the business. In addition to being very efficient, they are tidy, timely, and courteous. Helicon uses specialized drilling equipment. The compact design of Helicon's custom drill rig allows us to drill in hard-to-reach places while providing more than enough power to get through tough soil layers and reach deep limestone depths. Helicon takes special precautions to minimize the negative impact our repair process has on your property. We protect your lawn by placing plywood below our drill rig at all times. We also use wooden sheets to protect your walls and windows. Wood blocks are used to protect your lawn from the grout hose. We even protect your street with plastic sheeting under the grout trucks. If injection pipes must be inserted through pool decking or driveways, the smallest possible holes are drilled. When the injection pipes are drilled to the proper depth and angle, we begin pumping the grout. The grout is a mixture consisting of sand, cement, and fly ash. The formula ratios are specified by the engineer. The grout is injected into the ground at high pressure. This grout mixture doesn't mix with the ground soils, but pushes into the loose soils, compacting and strengthening them. The grout fills the voids in the soil and limestone substrate and creates a cap or seal. The grout is poured from the concrete truck into the TK40 concrete pump. It is then delivered at high pressure through the hose to each injection point. As the grout is being pumped into the ground, the pressure is monitored and the house is carefully observed to assure there is no structural movement that could cause damage. A high pressure reading indicates the soil zone at the current depth has been completely filled with grout and it is necessary to retract the pipe to the next soil zone. As each level is filled, the injection pipes are slowly retracted and then removed when the void is filled. Excess grout is collected in buckets and not spilled on your lawn, and each site is left completely clean. The pumping crew then moves to the next point, working their way around your house. When the compaction grouting process is completed, the structure is no longer in danger of sinkhole damage and your project is certified by the engineer. Helicon's experienced crew, using the latest in custom drilling equipment, will repair your sinkhole damage and protect your property in the process.